Shortcuts. Do you use them? Hey, this is Rod Davis. Today we will show you seven practical shortcuts when you use your inbox on Outlook 2016. Our first shortcut is a quick way to open a new email message. And you do that by pressing the keys Control plus Shift plus M. And there you have it, a new email ready for our work. Our second shortcut is to a way to select all messages in Outlook. This gives you a quick way to move or delete or copy batches of emails at one time. And you do this by pressing the keys Control plus A. And as you can see, all the emails have been selected. Our third shortcut is a way to delete an item or a selected group of email. And you do this by pressing the keys Control plus D. As you can see, the email selected has been deleted. The fourth shortcut is a way to mark a selected message as unread. And you do this by pressing the keys Control plus U. And you can reverse it by pressing Control plus Q to mark the message as read. In our fifth shortcut, we're going to show you how you can flag a message for follow-up or to remind you to take another look when you have more time. You do this by pressing the keys Control plus Shift plus G and you get a pop-up reminder. Our sixth shortcut is for those situations when you receive an email with a request from a friend or a colleague and you want to create a task so you don't forget. You accomplish this by pressing the keys Control plus Shift plus K. When you do that, you get a task window. And if you press on the Tab key, you can shift from one field of information to the next, which will save time as you fill in this task window. Our seventh shortcut is to show you how to jump between your inbox and your outbox, beginning with the outbox. You accomplish this by pressing the keys Control plus Shift plus O. To reverse that, you can shift to your inbox by pressing the keys Control plus Shift plus I. We hope you enjoyed part one of our practical shortcuts. Expect part two with more shortcuts in our next video.